Hello everyone, I can't believe it's actually been two months since my last video. I did um, have a video prepared for a few weeks back. Because my last video, um, which was entitled 666 and the testimony of YY, 6166 and spirals, and it's in relation to the uh, Mark of the Beast. Um, so I'll just play this clip in the background while I explain uh, what happened to it. So basically, um, this clip is from, I live in Northern England and um, whilst on holiday, I think this one, oh no, after holiday, I went to a few to these, um, you know, like um, preserved old English houses with like um, taxidermy, all that kind of stuff. This was just a room from one of the houses. Um, so it's like part of a preserved estate, as it were. And um, here I am just like uh, walking through one of the rooms, looking at the old like antiques and that kind of stuff. But um, I'll just get back to my uh, main point and get back onto this. So um, basically, a few weeks back, I went on holiday. I, w I went to Wales for a week. I went to Norfolk camping for a week. In Wales as well, I, I went up the... Me and my family went up the tallest mountain in England and Wales, which is uh, Mount Snowdon. And whilst there, you know, some things happen, and I connected um, uh, what happened to um, to this YY. And I thought I had a theory in place about it because it was racking my brain, and I prayed about it a bit, and uh, I was getting no solutions, and I thought I pretty much figured it out. Uh, and I came, when I came back home, and I was going to do a video, so maybe like two or three weeks ago, and the Lord told me, no, I was wrong. He told me not to do it. And I was I was a bit miffed, to be honest. Because I thought I had like a theory in place of what the Lord was showing me. And it was wrong. Until um, I saw, it was rocking my brain. And I was watching a video by um, Pastor Patrick Winfrey, uh, who's a one of the few, you know, modern day, prophets of our time and, and um, he's on on YouTube um, making videos got wrong tab open there so here's this video it's called uh, urgent rapture vision no more time and from say roughly the nine or ten minute mark he's talking about a dream which the Lord gave him uh, and he's also uh, referencing another youtuber um, I'll get to on a second who had um, a dream with a similar meaning. And when Pastor Patrick Winfrey was talking about um, this dream that the Lord gave him, uh, and this was for, from about five days ago, it was, it was talking about um, how we're at the end of time and there's a connection with the Lord gave him a vision on how, um, because the people have rejected Christianity, uh, the people are going back to the old gods, to the pagan gods. And also, it's like a, a double meaning, I think, it, it was saying to do with the uh, Israelites and um, the Jewish people and how um, um, they're going back. Well, the Lord is like taking them back um, to like a new start or a beginning um, to do with Judaism. I'm, I'm a bit unsure about details. I've just watched it again. It's like... It's, he explains it uh, probably way better than me. Uh, so it's all, it's all to do with, and he ties in um, the dream by a person called uh, Gary Bear, who's under the channel. Uh, there's actually made a comment, comment here if you look at this, uh, Bear049. So he had a dream about Trump, um, about Trump and how uh, um, Trump was wearing orange before he was arrested, like it's like some kind of prison suit or something. And like all the Christians are, or Trump supporters or whatever were wearing these orange suits and they had to walk backwards. So the theme here was going backwards. Uh, and I think I've butchered pretty much what Pastor Patrick was saying about the Jews. <laughs> Come to think of it. I didn't, I need to watch that part again. Um, but if you watch the video, it talks on for a good 10, 15 minutes about the meaning of this, about going backwards on how, um, you know, we're, we're the, at the end of time, it's coming at the same time as, you know, Trump wants to make America great again. And that's got like a another meaning to it on, on how, um, you know, um, we're at the end of time and the powers of that be, as it were, want to take us back before Christianity. That's basically what it's saying. 
I'm not sure if it was at the start of watching this video or even maybe the, the day before it occurred to me, even before I watched this, I can't remember. But it occurred to me what why why meant. What the Lord has been showing me why why. And I, could, and I couldn't think, you know, I went through a lot of meanings of why why, what could it mean. And it occurred to me what a yo-yo does, which is obviously why why. And a yo-yo, you know, I'll play, I'll play this video here. Will play. So this video here, you know, it's got a wooden yo-yo. It goes right down to the bottom of the string, and then as soon as it gets down to the bottom, it goes in reverse and goes backwards right up to the top. And I believe this is what the Lord has been showing me, a confirmation here to what uh, he has shown both Pastor Patrick Winfrey and also uh, to Gary Bear, uh, who both hear from the Lord. And this is a confirmation to what they're saying. It's so weird that, you know, the Lord showed me this why, why I started to now. It's like, on, I'm not sure the exact date, but on YouTube, it's coming up as I uploaded this video on why, why two months ago. And even before that, he started showing me why, why a good couple of weeks before that, before I made a video as well. And um, although the only difference of mine is um, I made a connection with this why, why um, as very much everything to do with the mark of the beast but given the fact that what pastor patrick was saying about you know the powers that be want to take people back to a time for christianity that is when the mark of the beast will come in so <coughs> i asked a lot about this so back to this house thing you're thinking why am i showing you a picture a video of this house right so the day after i watched i think it was the day after after i watched the video by pastor patrick winfrey and i was like well, yes, it is a yo-yo, what I believe the Lord was showing me. I, was, I asked the Lord then, the day before, uh, so the day before I even knew I was coming to this house um, because it was, um, my wife suggested it, you know, um, it was like the night before, I think it was. But before that, it was, a, it was a good, I think it was the morning of the same day or even the day before. Um, I was watching the thing about Pastor Patrick Winfrey and the... Um, they're going back um so while walking through this house oh no so on the way when i found out going to this house uh and i'm on the way at some point i thought to myself i prayed to the lord that he would show me a yo-yo in a very clear uh way um in a very clear way in a very prominent way in something very unusual he would show me a yo-yo to confirm that this theory uh, regarding the yo-yo and that is what the lord was showing me in regards to why why was in fact true that is so i asked the lord to confirm it um this is not in shot is it no um so then i said confirmation but then i thought i just uh i asked the lord for this confirma confirmation uh, i was thinking oh i'm going to the one of these um these posh country exhibition houses here so it's very likely that uh, if I walk through some kind of gift shop, I'll see see a yo-yo. Even though I haven't actually seen a yo-yo in years, literally years, I haven't seen a yo-yo at all, as far as I'm aware, or even use one. Um, so not in a few years. Um, so while walking through the house, I mean, on the on this la the last video I showed showed where you know all the uh, bric-a-brac and were antiques. I actually thought to myself about them. <laughs> It's quite unusual, actually. I've asked a lot from confirmation that I haven't actually seen a yo-yo. <laughs> I thought that would be real unusual. So I walked into this next room, um, and I couldn't believe it. So as soon as I had thoughts about, oh, the Lord hasn't shown me a yo-yo, even though this would be a good time, this is what happened. So I walked into this room, and I thought, whoa, literally a few seconds later, I looked, and the, this is the biggest yo-yo that I've seen. It must have been, you know, about four times the diameter of a normal yo-yo if you look at this yo-yo compared to this i think it's like a magazine here so that's like a a4 size which is roughly which is like us letter size which incidentally says the frog race game maybe it could be referring to the uh the game of politics and the race with uh, donald trump even i don't know but anyway so so i was stood there and zoomed in and filmed this and i, I could not believe it just I was, as you know, I was thinking about maybe the Lord will show me 
um, a yo-yo as confirmation for this thing. Not only did I see a yo-yo, but the biggest yo-yo that I've ever seen. And I thought that was quite something. So I'm putting this video here out as just a, a confirmation um, to for um, Pastor Patrick Winfrey's video and um, Gary Bear's video. I think I did watch Gary Bear's video. I'm not sure which one it was, but um, if you want to go to his channel. So this, so this is Pastor Patrick's channel. So it's Prophet Patrick Winfrey. And it's urgent uh, rapture vision, no more time. So that's the one you want to watch, and especially for the part that I'm talking about here in regards to going backwards. It's uh, from like nine, ten minutes ish. Uh, in regards to um, Gary Bear, here's his channel. He's even uh, made a comment in the live chat, which is um, Bear Zero Four Nine. Can I like it? Right, so here we are. I think there's something going on with the way that uh, my pen is clicking. So anyway, so here's this video, um, Bear, Bear 049, and here are his uh, videos. I'm just trying to think which video it could be. Uh, not sure, but go and watch his videos. So then, you know, one of these uh, top eight. Um, so apparently, um, Gary Bear was talking about the same thing as well. So anyway, thanks for watching. Um, I know I can ramble on sometimes, but uh, I never really rehearse my videos too much. Uh, so the Lord willing, I will be um, back for another video and pray that the Lord continues to show me things. I kept saying that I was going to go through my old videos and see what the Lord was showing me in the past um, and how they connect to um, what's happening now in the world. And um, Obviously, I'm over here in England, in the UK, so I have to be careful with my words, if you know what I mean now, with uh, what I say, to do with censorship and so forth, but uh, Lord willing, I will keep making videos and on what the Lord wants me to do. If you're not yet a born again Christian, I, I strongly urge you to accept Jesus Christ as your Lord and Saviour, because time is running out. So I you know, suggest that you get a Bible, you don't even need to get one, you can download it, an app of the Bible free. I would personally recommend the um, English Standard Version, uh, but you can also read the uh, King James Version if you, you know, think you can read Old English. But uh, the ESV, ESV is based on the King James Version. But if you're not a Christian, I, I would recommend the ESV, and then go on to the uh, King James Version. You know, as you progress. But I mean, I would just start reading the Gospels. Uh, I will start start with the Book of John. It's the easiest to read. And then I would read the book of Acts, and then I would progress from there, from Romans and so forth, and then whatever the Lord leads you to do. And just ask Jesus to reveal himself to you, you know, honestly, and just get yourself in a quiet place where you can pray and ask the Lord and say, if you are real, reveal yourself to me. You know, have an honest heart, and I believe the Lord will. So um, time is running out, you know. I think, I think we're at the end. Obviously, there could be a few more years, it could be a decade, I don't know, but I mean, the, the rapture of the church could be today. And it's at least seven more years, that's the uh, tribulation, but uh, you don't want to be in that. You want to get caught away, up with the Lord, and this is open to anybody who comes to him before before the rapture, you know. The first will be the last, and the last will be first. So, Lord willing, uh, I'll be back again with uh, another video, and uh, I'm going to pray about uh, what the Lord wants me to talk about next. Bye for now.